Pope Francis, born Jorge Mario Bergoglio on December 17, 1936, in Buenos Aires, Argentina, is the 266th and current Pope of the Roman Catholic Church. Elected to the papacy on March 13, 2013, he succeeded Pope Benedict XVI, becoming the first Pope from the Americas, the first Jesuit Pope, and the first Pope from the Southern Hemisphere. In a momentous declaration resonating from the venerable corridors of the Vatican, His Holiness Pope Francis has unfurled an announcement of profound significance. With an aura of anticipation enveloping the atmosphere akin to the lingering fragrance of incense in a grand cathedral, the pontiff has disclosed plans for an unprecedented event scheduled for the 8th of April. In a gesture cloaked in mystery and intrigue, Pope Francis has alluded to an extraordinary action beyond the scope of ordinary imagination that has ensnared the collective curiosity of the faithful and the world at large. To ensure that as many people as possible see this video, kindly take a moment to share this video and subscribe to this channel. May this message touch your heart and help to bring you close to the conversation of souls and the conversion of sinners. If you believe so, please type Amen. In the future, something amazing will happen in the skies over America. It's going to be like a show put on by the sun and the moon. The moon will move in front of the sun, casting a shadow on the earth. This will make the day suddenly turn into night for a little while. People all across the country will gather outside to watch this incredible event. The darkness will cover everything, making it feel like a magical moment. Even the birds will stop chirping, and it will seem like the whole world is holding its breath. For those lucky enough to see it, it will be like a magical experience, a chance to see just how vast and amazing our universe is. Pope Francis promised something special on April 8, and now everyone is curious to see what it will be. Get ready for something truly unforgettable. On the last day of his stay in the Vatican, Pope Francis revealed his intention to undertake an unprecedented action that would mark a historic moment for the Catholic Church and the world at large. With the knowledge that a rare celestial event, the last eclipse visible worldwide, was set to occur on April 8, the pontiff felt compelled to seize upon this unique cosmic occurrence as an opportunity for something truly extraordinary. Recognizing the significance of this celestial phenomenon, Pope Francis decided to harness its symbolism and magnificence to convey a message of unity, hope, and spiritual awakening to people of all faiths and backgrounds. This announcement sent waves of anticipation and excitement rippling through the global community, as the faithful and curious alike awaited with bated breath to witness what the revered leader of the Catholic Church had in store for this momentous occasion. On the special day, Pope Francis will get ready with important things like the holy water, the holy Bible, and a special candle. As the final eclipse starts happening, making the sky dark, the Pope will stand quietly, praying with his hands together under the fading sunlight. He'll ask God to watch over everyone during this dark time. When the eclipse is at its darkest, the Pope will light the blessed candles. These candles, shining brightly, will remind people of hope even when things seem dark. Each candle flame will represent the wisdom and love found in the Bible, showing that even when things are tough, people can find the right path with faith. This act will show how strong people's beliefs can be, even in hard times. The light from these candles will show that even in the darkest moments, God's love shines through, giving people hope. During this time, darkness will cover many countries, making it feel eerie and strange. People will stop what they're doing, feeling uneasy as they watch the sun disappear. In this darkness, 
old stories and fears will come to mind, making people turn to their faith for comfort. Pope Francis emphasized that the Holy Bible holds profound significance as a source of spiritual guidance and protection for all believers, serving as a shield of divine wisdom and love bestowed by God upon his children. In his teachings, the pontiff reiterated the importance of turning to the scriptures in times of trouble, highlighting its role in providing comfort, strength, and direction amidst life's challenges. He emphasized that the teachings and stories contained within the Holy Bible serve as a source of inspiration and support, offering solace and reassurance to those who seek refuge in its sacred verses. According to Pope Francis, the Holy Bible stands as a testament to God's unwavering presence and steadfast protection, serving as a beacon of hope and salvation for all who embrace its teachings with faith and reverence. On the 8th of April, Pope Francis, in his teachings to the children of Mary, imparted valuable guidance on the significance of the holy water and its usage for protection. He emphasized the importance of initiating the process with a profound act of faith and reverence. Before utilizing the holy water, one is instructed to engage in the symbolic ritual of making the sign of the cross. This gesture serves as a tangible expression of one's unwavering belief in the divine and their earnest yearning to receive blessings from the Almighty. By tracing the sign of the cross upon oneself, individuals signify their acknowledgement of God's presence, their reliance on His grace, and their openness to His divine protection. Thus, this initial step not only establishes a spiritual connection but also sets the tone for the subsequent use of the holy water, imbuing the ritual with deeper meaning and significance. He also foretold that a multitude of people would prostrate themselves upon the streets, their hearts uplifted in anticipation of receiving blessings descending from the heavens above. Throughout his tenure as Pope, Pope Francis has tirelessly championed causes centered around social justice, environmental conservation, and fostering dialogue among different faiths. His unwavering dedication to tackling some of humanity's most pressing challenges has earned him widespread acclaim and admiration. His profound concern for the welfare of the impoverished and marginalized has been a cornerstone of his papacy, as he continually strives to amplify their voices and address the systemic injustices they face. Moreover, Pope Francis has emerged as a vocal advocate for peace and reconciliation, consistently urging nations to prioritize diplomacy and cooperation in resolving conflicts. Pope Francis's humility and simplicity have also left an indelible mark on his papacy. In a world often defined by opulence and excess, he has chosen to lead by example, embracing a modest lifestyle devoid of extravagance. This deliberate rejection of luxury underscores his commitment to embodying the principles of humility and service ingrained within the Catholic faith. Throughout his tenure as Pope, Pope Francis has tirelessly championed causes centered around social justice, environmental conservation, and fostering dialogue among different faiths. His unwavering dedication to tackling some of humanity's most pressing challenges has earned him widespread acclaim and admiration. Thank you for watching till the end of our video. Our brothers and sisters, without fear and with more faith than in the past, let us continue in faith. Stay blessed and continue to pray for God to show all of us His graces and blessings. God bless us and protect us. Amen.